Hey yo, what is happening? It is your boy Big Moss. We're back at it with his memory over on Day Comics. Uh, be sure to link it down below in the description if you'd like to go check it out yourself. But we're here. Uh, last time ended off pretty crazily, you know. He viewed the memories of this guy's pain or uh, one of the guy's pain, like that he that he knows, and he, you know, saw that one of the jewelry that he bought his wife was in this dude's memory right so crazy shit happened crazy shit happened so let's see what happens in this one i would appreciate if y'all went to go check out the last reaction of his uh memory because you know gotta get the continuity correct you know for y'all motherfuckers top right card you see it let's get right to it Ugh. okay yeah, yeah this this right here this is his memory yeah yeah, right there. That that fucking necklace right there was the one that he got his wife. Only three of them has have been assigned to the country. We're the exclusive importer. Mmm. Huh? That's what I bought on the day Jisoo died. It's that necklace. From what I'm like seeing from like the like the titles of like the chapters, bro. It seems it seems the wife is sus too. That that that's what I'm seeing. From the titles, anyway. I, like, I had, I took a peep because, like, you know, like, I, while I was checking them out, bro, like, it looks like the wife is uh, a little sus, man. The transplant was successful. I can't believe this is happening. I, I did transplant his memories to me. The weather, the scene of the market, his face, and every single angle, uh, every single movement. It's so clear. Like, I've been through this. Jung Woo, why am I here? I can't remember how was was I drunk? I can't remember the fact that he deleted his memory and but he can't remember the fact that I, uh, he deleted his memory. Uh even why he's here in Wook, how does this make you feel? Do you feel anything? <laughs> what about it? You going to peel some fruits? Uh your wound in your stomach, don't you remember it? What wound? Take a look. Huh? What's this? In Wook, why do you think you're here? Of course, I'm here to see you to, to make you feel better. In look, in Wook, listen to me. I just deleted your memory and transplanted it to me. What? Holy crap! I know you can delete the memories of people with trauma, but I didn't know it was going to be me. I really had a trauma. You asked me first. Uh, you asked me to delete the trauma of uh, of a knife. Of course, it was my request to transplant your memory to me. Wow, this is unreal. It's too soon to tell you, but I think I deleted the trauma. Uh, you, uh, I deleted your trauma part. Well, interesting. Translation's a little weird, but I, I'm fine with it. But it, there's a much more important part. There's a much more important part. What is it? In your memory, I saw the necklace that disappeared the day Jisoo died. The diamond necklace. I heard that there are only three of them in Korea. The man you were chasing in your memory had one of them. Are you sure? Three pe uh, pieces in Korea? If that's the one you uh, bought, maybe there's a killer around there. Or he is the killer. Hmm. Maybe. Good evening. It's been a while. Hello, um. Can you recognize this necklace? Yes, of course. You told me that there are only three pieces of them in Korea. Is that true? Please excuse me. It's the same product. You, uh, you bought one of them a year ago. Uh, and the daughter of a, of the chairman in a lar uh, in a large company, uh, bought another one two months ago. And, uh, the other one he is here, as you can see. This piece is highly expensive that I can remember all the customers who bought it. <laughs> so, that was definitely your necklace for Jisoo. Hmm. If the owner is telling the truth, it's obvious that necklace, uh, that the necklace is related to the killer. He might be a killer or brought it from uh, bought it from someone else. I'll visit the prison. You won't be able to remember anything. Will it be okay? Can you remember him? He will remember me. He uh, he stabbed me for God's sake. I'll make uh, I'll have him. I'll have to ask him where he got uh, the things he had at the time. Uh, number twenty seven forty nine. You have a visitor. It was you. It's useless, but I didn't mean to kill you. I just wanted to scare you, but I got excited. 
It's okay. It doesn't mean anything to me now. Impressive. You're so fine in front of the man who stabbed you. Anyway, there's a reason why I'm here. From the jewelry you had when you were arrested. Do you remember this necklace? It was in your bag. Huh? Can you recognize this? Where did you get it? Well, think harder. You have to. If you don't, I already told you uh, during everything in the, uh, during the investigation. Uh, I was just a delivery man who carries the stuff. Then tell me uh, about the person you uh, gave, uh, who gave uh, you that stuff. Well, I don't know. Your son's quite smart. His name is uh, Jung Pil, right? Jung Pil Kim. <laughs> Recently, Jung Pil is placed uh, uh, was placed in on uh, pro uh, probation under the juvenile law. He had a smart uh, a small fight a smart fight <laughs> a small fight in school. Even if he studies well, I, I guess his school couldn't forgive him. Damn, that's tough. <gasps> Damn, I saw his, a student record. He's got good grades in school and trial exams. He could be a medical student if as he wishes. C can you help him? If you help me first, then I will. He is quite famous in this line of work. Hmm? He's a quite popular receiver. We call him uh, Jitney. It's hard to get closer. So who is he? I've never seen his face directly. What? That means you don't know him. I know his car number. I can remember. You remember his car number? After all this time, are you a genius? He asked me to get a plate. I made it for him. Sold uh, DA 22... Carnival. Interesting. So, DA 222. Okay. 2222. I stole a nice one from a junkyard and gave it to him. He really liked it. He, uh, he could have already disposed of it. It's an illegal car. He could have already uh, disposed it. Okay. This is it. Hey, my son, please help him. Please help. Uh, please take care of him. I'll tell him about him. Mm, how's it going? Doctor, this mail was for you. Mm, mail. Uh, the video that uh, Jung Woo Han requested has been restored. Uh, we are pleased to announce that our AI technology ha was used or has been used to restore. A, it's a high definition a HD. God damn. Thank you for using our company got the usb stick okay all right let's see let's see how crazy this is all right we got elevators parking lots and then apartment lobby okay all right there's gotta be a killer somewhere damn he's looking through all the he he's searching bro as you should hmm is that my mother-in-law? But she was on a trip that day. Mmm, <sighs> looks like... Yeah, why is everyone so sus, man? Everyone's so, so fucking sus in this. Obviously, you know, he is... I mean... Uh, no, I was about to suggest, like, maybe it was him. But that wouldn't make any sense. <laughs> because I was just like, maybe it was him from, like, you know... Like, that, like gain memories of somebody else or somebody and then thought he was him or I don't know it was some 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 uh convoluted ass plot that I was thinking of my mother-in-law yeah all right why is she here she wasn't uh in the CCTV uh, in the elevator no she was definitely on a on a truck mm, that day uh why would she lie to us and come to our home I even saw her uh, on a video call with uh, Jisoo and Sua in the evening. Mom, have a great time. Let's go together next time. Bye, bye. I love you. All right, Sua. See you soon. Hmm. Why did she lie to us? Wait. This isn't her. She looks like my mother-in-law, but her hairstyle is different. Maybe my aunt? Uh, did you see my aunt at the wedding? She looks just like my mom. Everybody thinks they're twins, even though my mom is two years older than her. <laughs> ah, I see, I see, I see. They do, they do look similar. At least a little bit. Okay. How have you been? 
I just sent you a picture. Yes, Mr. Han, I saw it. Is that Jisoo's aunt? Yes, it's her. It's her aunt. What is this picture? Uh, it's a picture of the apartment lobby on the day Jisoo, of Jisoo's case. Why did she go there? We haven't spoken in a long time. Can I have her number, please? Yes, I'll text it to you right now. Mom said she will do anything for money. Interesting. Even killing people. Wow. Did she? But did she kill, or did she like kill, or have uh those two killed? Hmm. No results for that plate, though. Unfortunately, the number is not registered. Yeah, I knew it. Just making sure. Thanks, Sunny. Uh, Sunny. By the way, uh, there are twelve traffic violations with that number. I think the police uh, officers recorded this number, but they couldn't catch the guy. Hmm. Do you think he changed his number? Well, maybe. You can find it at a used car market or a junkyard. I saw it on TV. They deal. Uh, they deal vehicles in private. Hmm. Yeah, I hope we can find it on the TV. Anyway, thanks. Dinner is on me sometimes. Damn. No, thank you. I'm freezing. Now you're refusing my dinner. If you catch the killer. You can have, uh, you can have, uh, you can, you have to buy me a big drink. <laughs> All right. I'll catch this guy and buy you a drink. Okay. See you later. Yes, sir. Buy her, uh, buy her a drink. What does that mean? I think she's definitely into me. All right. All right, gang. All right. Oh, she loved me. She loved me. Okay. There she is. Hello. Uh, I'm, uh, Jung Hoo Han, Jisoo's husband. It's been a long time. We haven't seen each other. Since your wedding. Why did you want to see me? It's about Jisoo's case. That day? The day she died? Yes. Did you see her that day? I'm sorry to ask you so quickly. Yes, I saw her. Really? Where? In her house. That can't be. You didn't show up on the CCTV from the elevator. For the lobby, you did. That's why I wanted to meet you. Oh, well. I saw her that day. I took the stairs. I didn't tell you at first because I thought you wouldn't believe me. The 19th floor? Of course it was hard, but I used to take the stairs instead of the elevator. I needed the exercise. Then why did you meet her that morning? I ran into her uh, the day before and she invited me over to chat. What time did you meet her? The day before the incident and what did you do? I went around 11 a.m. and talked about uh, my daily life for an hour. Jisoo uh, didn't even uh, ma uh, make lunch for you and let you go? She's not the type of woman to avoid making lunch for someone she hadn't seen in a while. What are you saying? Are you suspecting me? A year after her death? Ma'am, just tell me the truth. <laughs> All right. I asked her to lend me some money. She refused me right away. She said her uh, mom told her not to lend or borrow money with me. Understandable. You do not seem like a very uh, trust trustworthy person with money. <laughs> Honestly, I was upset. I adored her so much. And she's got money and a, and a famous husband. So? She didn't want to lend me money, but she said she'd give me some cash. That kind of the same fucking thing. I mean... I'm not some beggar, so I just left. I had to go to the terminal for my uh, other appointment uh, that afternoon in uh, Ch uh, Chionan. But why didn't you tell us the truth after the incident? Because of you. Huh? I'm not sure if I should say this, but Jisoo had a guy. Huh? What? Jisoo was seeing a guy? Yes, I saw them. They look so close. Jisoo had a guy? Mmm. So she was cheating. She was fucking cheating. Alright. Last chapter I'll do today, but holy fuck, she was cheating, huh? Hmm. Yeah. Holy f that's that's scummy. Okay, now we're we're going over here. Use car market. Alright. We're looking for the uh the car still or the plate at least no plate crashing and destroying cars you know you know the vibes uh my ears oh we just got a car a few days ago 
It's a hit and run a car. A black carnival. A black carnival? Hmm. Chisu had a guy? A guy? I'm sorry, but she definitely had a guy, a guy she was seeing. That's ridiculous. You asked me how I met Chisu, right? I ran into her at the cafe and saw her with a guy. They looked so close, and Jisoo was very surprised to see me. Maybe he was uh, kind of an acquaintance. Some kind of acquaintance. Just because uh, she drank some coffee at a, guy, a cafe doesn't mean she had a guy. It might be Sua's school teacher or her friend from university. She used to get along with all kinds of people. Do you think that I'm blind? I know what I saw. Who knows? If he's the one who killed Jisoo... Where was the coffee shop you met that guy? In the city near the expedition center. Expedition, yeah. <laughs> Exhibition center, there we go. Oh, and I think it was the company he works for. Some people uh, said hello to him. Mm, that company, do you remember where it is? Hans? Hans Law Firm? Uh, there is a moon bucks on the, fir uh, on the first floor. I've seen it, Hans Law Firm. I think they called him Lawyer Joe. A lawyer? He wore glasses, but I could see his eyes were so sharp. I still can't believe what happened to Jisoo. My sister got divorced when Jisoo was in middle school. When she raised her alone, I used to take her to uh, uh, take care of Jisoo all, all day long. Divorced? I heard Jisoo's di uh, father died right after she was born. Hmm. <sighs> Who's that that? Jisoo? My sister? I guess they lied. Well, it's not that important, but I guess they should, uh, shouldn't uh should have to call a living person dead. Okay, he's still alive. They just don't see each other. They just want to think he's dead. Because he was having an affair with someone when his daughter was a child. I used to say a lot of bad things about him. My sister and Jisoo, they suffered a lot. He did terrible things to his daughter and a wife. Yet he's doing well. Son of a bitch. What else uh, don't I know about her? No. How much did I know about her? Sweetie, deleting the past isn't isn't it just a trick? That doesn't mean that it uh, that it never happened. It's just foolish. Huh? Are you sure interfering with someone's memory can help them? Yes. If the patient wants. If you do uh, if you delete someone's memory. You might be stealing an opportunity. What opportunity? An opportunity to let uh, go of one's uh, one uh, his own memories that he uh, wants to erase. Uh, hey, Su Min's Child Counseling Center. Yes, uh, Jung Woo. Okay. How's Su Ah? She's in the counseling room. She's fine. Don't worry. Hmm. Was everything okay? I'm worried about her. Hey. Uh, when do we have dinner? You told me to, uh, you'd buy me a nice dinner. Did I say that? Okay, well, tomorrow. We'll be fine. All right. I'll take Sua to her home. What is Sua doing? I, I told Sua to draw her mom. She wanted to draw her first. Huh? Sua, excuse me. Jungwoo, what's wrong? I think we should meet now. Huh? Is that like her falling out the window? What the fuck interesting yeah <sighs> interesting that she's drawing her mom like that falling out of like somewhere but it looks like it's probably the building but i mean you never know what the fuck this could be to a child <laughs> in all fairness but interesting looks like shit's about to get fucking crazy with like you know like the revelations with if the wife is like you know a cheater or not like was she unfaithful or something like that i have a feeling she might have been with the way like you know like if she was actually genuinely surprised when you know uh when her aunt showed up i mean i understand like they weren't planning the meet but it was just like are you like so how why are you surprised you know maybe you were just meeting with a friend but i mean i don't know suspicious that she's just me She's meeting with a guy, not not telling her, her husband about it. Dick on the side, possibly. Anyways, I don't know. I, I don't really know if I'm excited to find out if she's cheating on him or not. But I mean, you know, 
I'm interested in to see where the plot goes. Because it thickened here, you know. Anyways, I got nothing else to say besides it's been your boy King Moff. So I'll be up fat as it's day. And I'll see you all later.